TV game. They won that game, by the way, 35 to 14. We pick it up in the third, second half action. St. Francis trailed six to nothing. I like the defensive effort right here, but De La Salle just be grinding the ball out. Reed Lawrence with a nice run, made a couple of dudes miss, but check out the Lancers defense. Solomone Pifoletti. I remember him last year. This is the 2.0 version of him. He looked bigger and stronger. Two plays later, Afoa to Ua with a hit in the backfield. Wow. And this one gave the ball back. Pifoletti with another TFL. He's a baller. Score remains six to nothing after three quarters. Let's go to the fourth, but not for long. Back-to-back -back runs, but the big boy tied it up. Shout out to number 35, Capellieli Passa. He made a touchdown saving tackles, but the Lancers got it in. Pifoletti, touchdown, six to six. Extra point was blocked. So now we go down to the wire. Atamai Matau with a stuff. I really hope I'm saying these names right. Nice play, nice play. Spartans need some yardage, but this play was broken up by Joseph Paulson. Great coverage by the sophomore. By the way, this was the last three minutes of the game and it was tight 6-6. De La Salle tried the right side, wide side again. But Matthew Luna also got a hand on that ball. And Coach Simpson, SJSU football alum, he was punked. 2.15 left. De La Salle was about to get the first, but Grant Regalis forced a fumble. Recovered by Reed Cole. And they went to work right away. Paulson with the keeper down the right side. That was a huge gain all the way to the Spartans' 27-yard line. And they scored to take the lead. Pafaletti with the early evening stroll to the end zone to put the Lancers up 12 to six. This is how it ended. Closing seconds of the game. Spartans needed the score, but Reed Cole ends it with a takeaway. Exciting JV game, 12 to six. St. Francis over De La Salle. Final score. <laughs> We got the varsity up next, but just a reminder, if you are a standout senior and would like to be part of the first ever GSF Senior All-Star Game in December, late December, have your coach or your parents fill out the form, the nomination form at GetSportsFocus.com. Gonna be epic. 2023 seniors, you deserve this. You missed five games due to COVID two years ago, and you deserve an extra game for sure. Get Sports Focus is brought to you by Summit Partners, leaders in growth equity investing, Ike's Love and Sandwiches, championship level sandwiches every single time, weightsandbars.com, build your home gym and shop locally from the Bay Area's best fitness equipment experts, and by South Bay Construction, a reputation built on trust. <laughs> All right, here we go. Varsity game coming up. St. Francis versus Dale Salle was the other game in our calendar with a big, huge circle. The Lancers took down the Spartans last year, and after Sarah took care of business last weekend, this game was a must to see how De La Salle would respond and how St. Francis would follow up on their victory over the Spartans last year. Unfortunately for De La Salle, Derek Thompson, he's a GSF All-Star, and he's got a boot on his right foot. Talk to his dad on the sideline and he'll be out for a couple of weeks. So that's good news. We'll be able to see him back later on in the season. Here we go. First offensive series of the game. Spartans on the move. Hard to see, but this was a QB keeper by Carson Suosue. He's good. He's very good. Tackle made by sophomore Jackson Cahoon. That's the brother of Chase Cahoon. Same drive. This one got me. Touchdown De La Salle. Suosu with the fake toss left and a tight end streak up the middle. Notre Dame bound Cooper Flanagan with a TD. Shout out to KT Prep. 7-0 Spartans. St. Francis looking to answer. Nice catch and run by Ryan Long. Matthew Doherty got it to him nicely first down. 
Lancers, but De La Salle's Chris Biller made a couple of big plays that forced a punt after that. Number 51, he is solid. St. Francis defense answered with this. Antonio Almeida, the second with a tackle for a loss. Junior Fiaui was also there. And then this, the ball was tipped and two-star DB Andrew Carskio with a pick. I like Andrew, he's a very good player. We gotta do a feature on him soon. And just to make sure, let's take a look at the intern cam shot in slow-mo. Yes, good job Manalo. It's Jackson Cahoon with the deflection, it turns out. And there's Andrew with the pick. Good job, Lancers. Lancers took over, 329 left in the first. De La Salle defense turned it up. Flanagan says, enough of this madness. QB sack with Dylan Greeson. And speaking of Dylan, check this out. 70 yard house call. That made it 14 to nothing, Spartans. We're still in the first. St. Francis put together a nice drive here and it started with a kick return by Kamau Julian. That was about a 54 yard return according to our intern. First and 10, Kingston Kiaaina put on some moves through the middle. Second quarter now, same drive. De La Salle defense made stops. Ball inside the 20, Biller with another no gainer. And St. Francis had to settle for a field goal. Leonardo Mayulo, he's good for 27, 28 yards on that. 14 to three, Lancers on the board. 940 left in the half. First play from scrimmage. Watch this hustle play by Kingston. Punch the ball loose to take away the touchdown. Kingston, he's a sophomore. Nice job. Score remained 14 to three at the half. Second half. Unfortunately, when you see the second half graphics, not a good thing for the team trailing. St. Francis got the ball back on this. Mayolo's punted ball touched the receiving team and they recovered the ball. Good job, Sione Tuilela. But the offense would give it right back. Freshman Jaden Jefferson with the pick. It's a freshman from varsity. That's big time. And it was all De La Salle from there. Toa Favae to JC Romo. 33 yard hookup, and that was a tough play to shoot. Romo made a great catch right in front of the goal line, and they scored. Toa hands it off to three star running back Charles Greer. 21 to 3, De La Salle with 443 left in the third. Still in the third. Another St. Francis turnover, and this was a nice play by Spartan sophomore Derek Blanche. Caught the ball in the flats, made two guys miss. Three guys miss and almost scored. Rolled down at the one. And watch the push right here by the De La Salle lineman, by the De La Salle O-line. Easy touchdown by Greeson, his second of the night, 28 to three Spartans with 2.47 left in the third. Last play, Toa. Go get yours, man. 27 yards to the house for the sophomore QB. De La Salle Spartans handled business, 35 to three over St. Francis. Talk about that first touchdown and, and just coming out this week uh, after a big loss to Sarah. Yeah, I mean, um, it's definitely a bounce back game losing to them last year too, so just momentum for this year. You know, we put in a lot of work. We just came out and performed good. You know, we had a chip on our shoulder. You know, we had to come out and perform and we did just that. Just physical football and we got to work on putting teams away, so just stepping on teams' throats, really. What can we expect from you guys the rest of the year? Uh, I think we have a uh, great... I think we have a great road ahead of us. You know, expect the same thing if not better.